Hello, friends. It's Nobby. I've just arrived here today, Tokyo Skytree Town. This is the first visit to the Tokyo Skytree since its opening 11 years ago. Okay, let's go! The escalators look like a multi-level highway. This is so amazing! This is Tokyo Solamachi, a shopping complex within Tokyo Skytree Town. My reservation time is noon, so I'm going to have lunch before the Tokyo Skytree visit. There are many restaurants on this floor. Ramen might be a good option, but I'm going to have ramen tonight with my hubby. Sushi is good too, but I don't want to queue for a long time. I haven't had a skiaki for a while. I'll have it today. I'll enjoy Matsuzaka beef. I'm the only one enjoying lunch on my own. The food has come. When ordering, I asked for half the rice. So, don't worry, your rice should be served more. There is a bowl of Japanese egg pudding in the top of right hand corner of the screen. We usually eat sukiyaki on cold days. But I am eating it in the midsummer. I'm full. Let's go to the observatory. The observatory entrance is connected to this floor. There are many shops to see here. There is still some time left, as I can enter the observatory between noon and 1 p.m. I'm playing Pikmin 4 now, but before playing it, I was playing this game. Don't forget Pokemon Center, the official Pokemon shop. This is big enough, but not the biggest Pokemon Center in Japan. The biggest Pokemon Center is the one in Ikebukuro. Not only Nintendo shops, but also you can enjoy many other shopping. Let's take a look at some of the shops available. I got out from Tokyo Solomachi for the observatory entrance. Not so crowded today as it's Friday noon. I have already purchased an advance ticket. I strongly recommend you to purchase the ticket in advance. The advance ticket is 400 yen cheaper than the same day ticket. You can purchase it online. Check the link in the description of the video. 
Tokyo skyscraper changes its shape as it goes up, from a triangle at the base to a circle at the top. Let's move up to the upper observatory, Temple Deck. It takes about 50 seconds to reach the elevator. The elevator travels at the maximum speed of 600 meters per minute. It is cloudy today, so the view is not far away. Flowing through the center is the Sumida River. This is the Asakusa area. Can you see the building with the golden object on the top? That is Asahi Beer Hall, one of the buildings of Asahi Brewery's headquarters. The golden object at the top is said to represent both the burning heart of Asahi Beer and the frothy head, but some people call it the pool building. The construction was completed in 1,325 days from the groundbreaking on 14 July 2008. In the above-ground construction, the tower was extended at an average rate of about 7 meters in a week. Let's move to the upper observatory deck. And by the way, why did Tokyo Skytree need to be built? It is because there was a need for the broadcast tower, which is over 600 meters tall to deliver stable radio waves. Due to its high resistance to earthquakes, wind, and fires, Tokyo Skytree also serves as an information infrastructure in time of peace and disaster. To tell the truth, I'm not good at height. This is the highest point of the observatory deck. It is 451.2 meters above ground level here. Let's move back. The elevators have longer guide rails than regular ones to reduce the number of connecting parts and minimize wind resistance. These efforts have made it possible to ensure completely silent when a 500 yen coin standing on the floor does not even fall. She is the mascot character of Tokyo Sky Tree. Okay, I'm a bit scared, but let's go to the glass floor. The floor is decorated with Japanese patterns called Edokomon, Japanese traditional dyeing technique for kimonos. It's speechless. Okay, 
I'll have some coffee here. I'm not hungry after lunch, so I'm having a cup of cafe latte. The pattern used on this window is also a traditional Japanese design used on kimonos. As far as the eye can see, it is buildings all the way around. This view makes Tokyo, Tokyo. Tokyo Sky Tree Town is a much more enjoyable place than I thought it would be. It is fun to visit alone with friends, with your partner, or with your family. Food is the otaku, and all lovers of Japanese culture will enjoy to be here. Why not put Tokyo Sky Tree on your list of places to visit in Tokyo? Thanks for watching the video. Give me likes, subscribe, and ring the bell. See you in the next video. Bye bye. Matane.